Hi everyone, welcome to Rachel Pickler Yoga. My name is Rachel. Today we are gonna stretch out our neck. So it's gonna be a fairly short, simple, sweet, all good things. So just remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Find a comfy seat and let's get started. All right, so finding that nice comfy seat we're actually gonna start by taking a few shoulder rolls just to loosen things up a little bit. So you can start by bringing the shoulders up towards your ears, really, really high, and then pull them back and drop them down. And then do that again, bring them up, pull them back, drop them down, and then make this one a little bit more smooth. <laughs> Perfect. All right, so sitting up nice and tall, we're gonna bring our chin towards the collarbone. So just bringing some length into the back of the neck. We're gonna keep our shoulders nice and soft here. Hmm. So we aren't gonna be moving a whole lot today because our neck is a pretty small area. So I encourage you guys to Keep your eyes closed if you're comfortable doing so. Just feel your breath. And settle into the stretch. And with that chin falling down towards the collarbone right now, I'm gonna keep it there for another moment. Just letting the head be heavy. And then you're slowly, slowly I'm just going to roll your head over towards your left shoulder. So keep that chin kind of tucking towards your chest. Roll your head over. And then your ears kind of trying to find your shoulder. Feeling this now through the side of your neck. We're just starting off nice and gentle. Oftentimes, I don't know about you guys, but for me, I, I don't realize how much my neck needs a stretch or is tight until I start to stretch it. <laughs> so this feels pretty darn good. So nice and slow, you guys, let's switch sides. Bring the chin towards the chest again. All the way towards that collarbone. Let the head roll all the way over to the other shoulder. Just going until you find that gentle stretch of the neck. If you are starting to slouch and relax, I want you to grow a little bit taller through your spine. And then once you do that, drop those shoulders from the ears again. Nice work. So let's gently bring the chin all the way back down. Gently roll the head back down. Chin's coming to the collarbone. And then we're gonna use an inhale to lift the chin back up. So we're just gonna be bringing our hands behind our head for some support. And we're gonna move into the front of the neck. <clears throat> so just place the hands, I like to just kind of cup the bottom of my head, <clears throat> just there for support. And you're just going to start to lift the chin away from the collarbone. So that you might lift just a little bit. You might lift a little bit more. But just use your hands behind your head just to hold all the weight. So your arms might get a little bit fired up here. <laughs> And very slow, we're just going to bring our chin all the way back down to neutral. Neutral, and then you're going to release our arms to our lap. So, just kind of wiggle the shoulders a little bit. We are going to do that all one more time. 
with the option to go a little bit further. So if that was perfect for you, it was it was a deep stretch through the neck, you're just gonna do the exact same thing. If you want a little bit more, we're just gonna use some weight from the arms just to add a little bit more um, of a stretch. But let's be gentle, just acknowledge where you're at and be nice to your neck, be nice and gentle with the neck. So we'll start with the back of the neck. The chin's coming towards the collarbone. Yes, maybe you're staying here like we were before. Just let the head be heavy. Hmm. Maybe you want to clasp your hands behind your head and then just use the weight from the arms to take you a little bit further. But try not to pull on your head, just let the arms be heavy. If you were using your hands on your head, just let them go back to your lap. And then we're all gonna let our head roll over to the left shoulder again. So move nice and slow. If you need to take a break, you can take a, a break. But let the head roll over to that left shoulder. Start to feel that stretch to the side of your neck. Stay here or maybe the left hand is gonna be a little extra weight on the head. But again, not, not pulling on the head, just letting the hand rest and the arm be a little heavy. And just a little longer in this one. If you want a little bit more of that right hand, it can actually reach for the floor. And as you drop that shoulder a little bit more, you might feel that extra length through the neck. Nice work, you guys. So whatever hands you might be using, I want you to let them go. Just keep your head falling over towards that left shoulder. And then slowly, slowly, let's let the chin fall back down and go all the way over to the right side. And then just take a moment. Again, if you started to slouch, sometimes that happens. Let's sit up a little taller. Maybe adding your right hand. Maybe not. And if that left hand also wants to reach out for the floor, you can start to do that now. Nice you guys. So let the hands go. Slowly drop the chin towards the collarbone. Pause here, recenter, relax your shoulders. And then let's use an inhale to bring the head back up or the chin back up. So just a little wiggle of the shoulders, a little rock of the chin. <laughs> We've got one more. We've got to do the front of the neck one more time. So if you'd want the hands behind the head for support, bring them behind your head. You can start to lift your chin. Some of you might feel that the hands behind your head actually prevent you from lifting the chin a little further. So you might want to have your hands on your knees and just lift the chin, let the head fall back, only go as far as you need to or as you're comfortable going. We don't wanna force anything. Nice. Just feeling all that length through the front of the neck, under that chin. And then super slow, you guys. You might want your hands to help you come back nice and controlled. Awesome work. All right, just move a little bit. Maybe even give yourself a little massage of your neck. So who thinks that was super simple and you could have done that all on your own had you just thought to take a seat and stretch your neck. I know. 
if only we could do this every day, just get into the habit, we'd feel amazing, I'm sure. But sometimes just doing super simple things, we forget about. And we need somebody to remind us that we don't have to do all these fancy stretches to get a really good stretch. So I hope that you're feeling some love through your neck. Move around if you need to move. Continue giving yourself a little massage. Ooh, do it one more time. <laughs> Whatever you need, you guys. Until next time, bring your hands together in front of your heart. Namaste. Have a great day.